tourism expected to be a major feature highlighted at the 2015 Caribbean Investment Summit in London. The nation's chief who led the region as CARICOM chairman for the first six months of the year is expected to outline the successes and struggles CARICOM faces at that investment summit in London. But as we hear from Clint Watson, ahead of that event, the tourism minister focuses on how the Bahamas' record is expected to overshadow the Bahamar dilemma. A day ahead of his keynote address to potential investors in the Caribbean region, Prime Minister the Right Honorable Perry Christie is finalizing his presentation that the region is open and ready for business. The Bahamas will feature prominently in his presentation here in London. Tourism Minister the Honorable Obi Wilshkum says he'll convey that investor confidence in the Bahamas is high. What the Bahamas has today are good policies. Uh, we have uh, stability. Uh, we have... Um, legislative or parliamentary stability, democracy. We also have a um, um, law system that people certainly respect globally. So I think all the qualities reflect the opportunity for the Bahamas and they add up and the Bahamas could uh, certainly be a leader uh, in the world community of all the uh, opportunities that exist. And he won't shy away from the Bahamar issue, especially as it is the single largest investment in tourism in the region. Minister Wilscombe says it's not being viewed as a distraction nor negative issue. The brand and that brand uh, uh, is respected and I don't think it's going to be a distraction. It will serve as uh, obviously an opportunity to talk about even Bahama and the brands that it attracted. So it's how it's uh, dealt with, but I think the Prime Minister certainly will use the occasion to talk about uh, circumstances, situations uh, that make it positive to invest in the Bahamas. Expect the delegation to brag about the latest figures in tourism, which has shown improvement for the Bahamas. Uh, within the um, Americas, we're number 12. Within the CARICOM uh, community, English-speaking Caribbean, we are uh, number one. Uh, we're doing quite good uh, in the world community we're number 58 so um, i think the bahamas should be very proud we have work to do and um, if we're going to be on top of the list you have to ensure you have the inventory you have to ensure you have the airlift and of course the product as a sidebar this comes at a time of celebration here in great britain and the prime minister is visiting as you may be aware the queen elizabeth is celebrating being the longest serving monarch here in great britain as a milestone achievement that everyone is celebrating and it's happening right outside of her home here at Buckingham Palace. In London, Clint Watson, ZNS Network News.